Hello, everyone. This is Waldorf. <laughs> you sure? <laughs> and this is Statler. I don't know anymore. Yeah. Uh, this is Battle Report 212. 212. Cool. This is our second second game at the team tournament, Colonial Carnage. Orcs and Goblins versus Ogrecons at the Williamsburg Muster. This is this is where you start your ascension? This is. <laughs> started off, I you know, did the sandbagging on the first turn. Sandbag to, you know. Threw the game to a guy just to get us a low rating. Exactly. So, you know, they're building some complacency on your opponents. Exactly. They look at me and say, oh, okay, this guy can't play. Exactly. This this will teach him a lesson. All right. So here's the Ogre list. <laughs> a very odd list. Uh, great Con with Great Weapon. And Brace of Ogre Pistols. He's mm -hmm. the general. Okay. Never and he's knows. got a three, four, five. Not sure what that is. <laughs> That's how much he cost. <laughs> yeah. Uh, he's got a con BSB with a cult. He's a cult leader with maybe, a brace of pistols. Maybe he's learning how to count. That's as far as he's got. Could be. <laughs> <laughs> he skipped the one and two. <laughs> yeah. Uh, two cons with great weapons and braces of pistols. Brace of pistols. He was holding a chicken leg and he couldn't get his other fingers pointing. <laughs> <laughs> uh, shaman, who's an adept of shamanism. Okay. He has the Liger's Tongue and an Iron Fist. Mm -hmm. And a Shaman, an Adept of Pyro with a great weapon. Okay. Who's a Firebrand. So, so two Adepts, a whole bunch of cons. Oh, two Adepts, three cons, and a great con. Okay. So six characters. And the thing to point out is six characters, one oh. magic item. Yeah, I see that. <laughs> I'm not seeing a lot of... Uh... And three great big names. Yeah. He's got the Cult Leader, the... like. I mean, the... Fire, cult leader and firebrand, I guess two. Two, yeah, so I see. Two of them. Yep. Okay. Uh, two units of nine tribesmen, both okay. with Iron Fist in full command. One has the pennant of the Great Grass Sky, which gives them swift stride. Right. Two units of three bombardiers with musicians. Okay. A pair of saber tooth tigers. Mm -hmm. Three tusker cav with paired weapons. Okay. And a frost mammoth. All right. So he's got two big blocks with characters in them, looks like. He does. If I'll find that in a second. <laughs> you will. Um, again, this was a, what I consider a yellow match. Okay. Um, yeah, you normally match up okay against uh, ogres. ogres with ogre, with yeah. orcs and goblins. So we had the deployment where um, we did the counter thrust. So I dropped the, you know, wolf riders right there in the center. Mm -hmm. He put the uh, guys over there on the far right. Bombardiers. Mm -hmm. Bombardiers. I put the you know, little unit of, you know, I dropped my other wolf riders and this, got this unit of Nashers in the woods. Mm -hmm. His second and third were the two saber tusks you see up there on the top of the board. The two tiggers, uh-huh. Um, so then I deployed. You dropped everything. Okay. I expected him to go to the right. To your right? To my right. Um, but that wasn't the case. Why would you? To get away from that ruin in the center. Okay. That's what I was expecting. Okay. Um, but... He did not. He went hard left. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah. So we've got... Now I don't think my trolls can get any further from this fight. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so we, this, so starting up here, he's got a hill, a ruin, a impassable thing okay. here. Hill on the far right, another impassable, tiny little field here, mm -hmm. water feature, and a forest. Okay. Yeah. So... I'm looking at this and I'm like, okay, well, the trolls move 12, so mm -hmm. probably not all bad. It's only going to be 12, 12, 12, four turns before they can get into anything. Mm -hmm. Send them out that way, yeah. I, that, what, I'd have no really choice. They, mm -hmm. I don't even know if they can wheel past this house. Yeah. But anyway, just a ter uh, not a good deployment. Mm -hmm. um, he deploys. He's got three characters in each one of these um, yeah. blocks. Uh, you know, Tuskers and a pair of the, the, mm -hmm. uh, hand gun, the Bombardiers. Are those like the um, 40k giant wolves with ogres on them that he's using for his cavalry? I think so. Okay. The big uh, white wolves or yeah, whatever yeah, they were. Yeah, called now. Yeah, yeah I think yeah. so. Okay. Um, so, uh, Vanguards in movement mm -hmm. take place. I swap over here, you know, I move my 12 inches with my ogres, my mm -hmm. trolls. Um, wolf riders come around to the flank. Wolf riders come up here, sit in the ruin, mm -hmm. hoping to attract somebody to charge me into the ruin. Um, did that one slide off the, or is he dead? Yeah, he slid off. Okay. He just fell off the back. Magnets weren't holding. Okay. Um, and managed to keep my, of course, keep the general and BSB within troll range, mm -hmm. just in case. 
Uh, so, uh, also you can't see it, but under his hand is the um, spell I got off for this turn, which was the uh, Break the Spirit. Okay. On the little unit of Bombardiers. It's going to give them a minus one to shoot. So they decide, since they own minus one to shoot, they're going to charge. Mm -hmm. They take dangerous terrain for the open. He takes three wounds and loses one. His six checks getting him into the ruin loses another one. Yeah, it's a lot of checks. So, yeah, it's was two, four, six, and four, I guess. Um, anyway, so <laughs> combined, you lost two models. Yeah. Uh, a little harsher than it should have been, but... That's a lot of rolls. I mean, six rolls on ones and twos, you lose two. You mm -hmm. lose, I mean, you take three. Yeah. And then you take one and a little bit for the second one. Yeah. You end up taking six total. Yeah. Still not good for him, but anyway. Uh, over here, the um, bombardiers, they uh, reformed and Form. switched out this way. What, and what he's doing is he's, you know, making me charge him here. Which mm -hmm. is going to slow me down from getting over to the other side. Yeah. Um, rest of his army, you can see, fans off to the left, to my left, and gets ready, keeping this unit with a Swiss Stride banner parked on the hill. Mm -hmm. But I'm not that concerned. I mean, I would love to get a unit right here and get the Kirk the break the spirit off on him. Right. <laughs> Take the hill, the open, then the hill, mm -hmm. and the ruin. Is that character a new model for him? No. With the big he, red it's, shield? It's always been as big it's always been a great con model for him. I've seen But he's seen never he, I don't recall seeing it. That's correct, because he never really runs the Great Con. Oh, okay. I mean the Great Con most people will tell you don't run. Right. Most ogre players don't run a great cons yeah, anymore. Yeah. So anyway, so that's what that was. Okay. Um yeah. uh, Bombardiers fire and kill one. Uh, he charges <laughs> He has three attacks. He does a wound, and I do a wound back to him. Okay. My general and BSB are around, so we stick That's around. Understand. Okay. He was minus one to hit. So yep. Needed fours to hit me. Going on to turn two. Uh, that's what it looks like. I'm not crazy about this. So the uh, Nashers, I was trying to slide to the left to get mm -hmm. past him, but after we after I checked, we checked the arc, he couldn't do it, so I just backed up. Okay. Uh, if he wants to come get me, he's got to come through the woods. Right. Um, got that. I think somebody's calling to tell you that was a mistake. You think so? <laughs> it's probably my opponent calling yeah, to tell probably me. Probably was, yeah. It's my <laughs> opponent calling to tell me how dumb this was. You have no chance. <laughs> so the trolls on the right did charge the bombardiers who fled. <laughs> uh, you can see where they fled to. And that's a um, dangerous terrain kills another one. Right. But that's six checks is on oh, checks on three, mm -hmm. one to threes. Right, right. Um, so uh, Nashers and the Boar Boys come up. Mm -hmm. Wolf Riders get in position to shoot that saber tooth tiger, and everybody else just gets ready. Mm -hmm. I can't again. I can't move. I wanted to put the. I wanted to push the Boar Boy unit forward. But you have an anchor. But I've got my anchor dragging behind mm -hmm. me. So was not able to do that. Mm -hmm. um, anyway, I did. I did get off the spell um, "Awaken the Beast" for plus one strength on this unit because <laughs> I had a die. I had one die left at the end of the phase. I was and saying, said, okay, why were you bothering? Okay, that's why you have one die left. I had one die left, and on a f all I needed was a four. Right, right. So it's a fifty-fifty chance to get it off. Mm -hmm. So it got off, and we traded wounds again. Okay. Um, so now he's got two wounds. I've got mm. three guys left. Um, so uh, there you go. That's much better. So going into the next turn, that's what it looks like. This unit is, you know, it's where it is. It's like I can take one of them. So he declares both charges with um, this unit on the hill and this unit over here. He has a rerollable 11 with this one and a 9 over here. Mm -hmm. I'm not that concerned because I think I can take either one of those units. Individually, yes. But I can't take them both. Yeah. And there they are. He made both his charges. Well, even the one's not fun with all those characters in there. but uh, I think I would be... I mean, I'm going to be steadfast. I guess they got great weapons, don't they? They're going last. Yeah. I think I'm okay. Yeah. 
Um, but they go, they're going first. It's a lot of attacks, but yeah. Right. I mean, he's going to do impact, mm -hmm. and then you know, the way I was looking at it, he does impact, and he's got nine attacks mm -hmm. from the second row, mm -hmm. and then I go. Yeah. And then it's him. So mm -hmm. anyway, um, but I, like I said, I definitely can't do two of them. Mm -hmm. There they are. A couple of pictures of that. It's a fantastically painted army. Mm -hmm. It's got that going for it. It is. Um, yeah, lots of pictures. He gets off flaming swords and children of Umi. I could not stop anything this round. Mm -hmm. um, so that's going to make it even worse. So after his all attacks, after all his attacks, I have a champion to go back. Okay. I'm thinking that's not going to go out well. At least yeah. still got a guy with great con with great weapons. Yeah. <laughs> um, at, least, so I, at least only one of them can swing at you. So I take a couple swings and his great con splats me and the unit turns the face. Yeah. And the um, Tuskers don't want the, the Nashers in the flank. They pursue, he, they yeah. Advance, oh, so they, they, they just overrun. Through, overrun, thank you. And <laughs> leave me hanging out there. Okay. Uh, the Wolf Riders, however... Are victorious. Are victorious and smash the ogre. Mm -hmm. uh, Saber Tusk over here comes to table two. Chaff up your, comes up to chaff up my boar boys. Keep them out of it. Mm -hmm. And he's got the other one in reserve. And the other one's still hanging out back here in reserve. Um, so go to turn three. All right. So the wolf riders declare charge at the Saber Tusk, Saber Tooth Tiger, mm -hmm. and he flees. Mm-hmm. Um, hope I got a good picture of this next one. Okay. So he flees, um, which I was kind of hoping he would stand, but he doesn't. Yeah. Um, why would he? <laughs> well, he does cause anyway, why would he? I don't know. Cause it's going to take a four to rally five to rally with that thing. Mm -hmm. That's why. Cause it's gone. He loses his chaff piece and anyway. So anyway, cause he didn't notice the next thing, the spider. Declare now declares a charge on the mammoth, right? With a, uh, a swift stride eight, I believe it was, mm -hmm. and rolls into him. Mm -hmm. and the Nashers come into the front. Mm -hmm. So, we got the and the, if you hadn't you noticed the Wolf Riders are up here with the ah, blur. So they decided to go into. They had to clear the space for the right. uh, spider. Right. Um, and they made it out of the rubble. Okay, the ruins. Okay. And one, two of them did. Mm -hmm. There's two of them, only yeah. two there. Um, so they did that. The Boar Boys came up to uh, chaff this uh, right. big unit, big block, because the my Boar Boys have to go smash the right. saber tooth, and the trolls are. F and <laughs> if you notice, Somebody's last missing. turn, okay. the the um, the BSB shifted over to okay. the trolls. Mm -hmm. The other thing that we I missed announcing on that turn was the these Boar Boys that set up here on the hill had a rerollable eleven at these. At the back corner of this unit, mm -hmm. so they tried it and, and they got it. on the second shot made it. Okay, got into them because mm -hmm. um, we are playing flags and that is a scoring unit. Okay, uh, the Wolf Riders, the other second unit of Wolf Riders, shifts over here, mm -hmm. and it's very blurry. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> you killed it. I kill it. <laughs> And turn around. And turn around. He put his attacks into killing. He knew he wasn't going to hurt much, so he decided to make sure that the wolf riders died and didn't stick around as chaff. Mm -hmm. So he killed those. And one Nasher. And one Nasher. I brought in also last. Was it last turn? I think last turn. I brought in a totemic summons. Oh, okay. there he is back there. See him. Mm -hmm. I brought well, him on in the edge or with a uh, ten. Uh, within the edge, okay. I had to go through low casting. Okay. I brought in a totemic summons last turn. Mm -hmm. um, and oh. this turn he took a random move and rolled like a 15. Okay. Because I wanted him to end up down here somewhere. <laughs> right, right. But he got like a 15 and shot all the way out here. Ah, so you put him up that way, not along the side. Well, okay. he's he's right here. This is yeah. this is where the corner of him is in this uh, mm -hmm. marker again. Because mm -hmm. um, I went right across the front of him. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to hit the side of this unit. Mm-hmm. Um, because I didn't want to, wasn't sure that this was going to overrun was going to make it. Right. So I didn't want to give him the opportunity to kill it and then just turn and face down the hill. Yeah. Um, so that's why that, that's why I did it that way. Yeah. Uh, so there we have that. 
Um, and I did get the uh, Break the Spirit off on this unit. Okay. So if he wants to go somewhere, he's going to take a whole lot of tests. Mm-hmm. So, and I positioned the spider. The spider, after it killed the woolly mammoth, the frost mammoth, mm -hmm. just pivoted 180. Right. And turned just as much as it could to get stay out of an inch of this unit, mm -hmm. but was able to get the front corner in the right. arc. Be able to see line of, still have right. line of sight. Okay. So because of that, and because of the uh, break the spirit, he decided just to back just up to an back inch up. or two. Yep. Um, Tuskers come around mm -hmm. to the right. And yep, so he leaves my boar boys alone. The stupid tiger back here rallies on a five. It was out of it was out of his command zone. Yes, okay. this is a commander here with only twelve. Oh, he doesn't have the thing that's eighteen. Okay, uh, that's the BSB. Oh, yeah, BSB. Yeah. Um, but anyway, he rallies on his five, mm -hmm. which is irritating. Um, and uh, kind of looking around, Nashers. <laughs> oh, he did charge you. Okay. What's this? No, I charged, oh, oh, charged the Overran was in his flank. Oh, okay, okay. So the Nashers go to work and knock out three three Ogres mm -hmm. and take nine back in return. Okay. Um, but we had nine, a flank, and a charge. Uh, it was actually, I think it turned out to a straight push. Okay. And he ended up there. And he reformed to... And he reformed to face him <laughs> because he's got to kill him anyway. Might mm -hmm. as well kill him. Good. Um, uh Da -da, moving on. Okay, so. <laughs> so your turn now. So it's my turn, and my boar boys are here. Mm -hmm. Were here, right? At, they were right. You know, right here facing where they wanted to be, and I was happy with their placement. And if you recall, I had four wolf riders here. Yes. And the boar boys here. Mm -hmm. um, so I decided to. What was I going to do? Oh, I was trying to. Pres first thing I was trying to do is preserve the unit of boar boys. Okay. So the boar boys made their march test mm -hmm. while the general was here with them, made their march test and walked over this way through the ruin and failed their leadership. You take two casualties from the ruin, right? failed their uh, leadership nine check and mm -hmm. fled out of the ruin over to here. So those are boar boys. Right those there. are the boar boys. Okay. But remember, if you remember, I had four wolf riders. Here. Yes. So the full wolf, so I, because I don't want to move the boar boy, this big unit of boar boys, I don't want them out of the way, but I don't mm -hmm. want them double charged. Right. So now, so the wolf riders say, okay, well, we'll come over where you're chaff. They come through, mm -hmm. take two wounds mm -hmm. from the ruins, fail their nine leadership check. Okay. Run back through it and take two more dangerous terrain checks coming out of it and disappear. So... Both units gone. I'm sorry, you're confusing me. You went in, you took your two casualties. Yep. And you failed failed, failed my break test because I panicked. Okay. And but you didn't leave the terrain feature. Uh, no, I was going to because I was close to the. This is my right, closest cause, cause unit. You failed as soon as you 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 took the because you take the casual when you hit the terrain. Right. And they're in the they're they're in the terrain when you take it. Right. So they take it leaving the terrain. I, I've always played. So you take a you take a double roll in that situation. I think so. Oh, okay. Maybe not. Mm, it's a good thing to look up. Okay. Because I mean, you just technically haven't really finished a move. You kind of move. I don't know. I'm just asking. So that's yeah. a good question. Yeah. Don't know. Um, that's the way I played it. Yeah. Okay. Right or wrong. Um. Anyway, so they failed and they died running out of it. Okay. So because of that, the board boy unit that's here, the big this big. Ed Basher boy boy mm -hmm. has to take a full four, 14 inch move to get out of the okay art because I have I just killed my two chaff pieces and right. these two are the only thing left. Um, could have sent a character out there. I could have. Um, unfortunately, it would have been my 480 <laughs> point 60 point mage because <laughs> the, uh, the BSB or my you know 350 point BSB which yeah. adds another 200 when you kill He's it. He's kind of far away. <laughs> he probably could have made it with a run into the ruin and yeah. die. Yeah, there you go. Uh, um, <laughs> So anyway, so the um, the spider about faces and gets mm -hmm. ready to face up here, an inch behind this Nasher, and your and summons, the summons into the flank, poured into its flank. Mm -hmm. Yep. Uh, there we have that. 
and you can see barely see the Nashers coming around the corner just so they'll have room to dash through this gap and hopefully smash something. When you do a um, when you do a random movement that turns into a charge, do you have to maximize? You do. Okay. Yep. When you roll the die and it's determined you have enough to reach it, it becomes yeah. a normal charge. Okay, so you do have to maximize. Yeah. Right. Um, it also allows you to make some maneuvers during the charge too, mm -hmm. if you want to, because it becomes a normal charge. Right. Um, so anyway, so we got that. Um, he does nothing, and they this unit smashes the summons. Oh, okay. Well. No. And he well, just a uh, wow, just uh, regular guys. Yeah, he turns to face down the hill. Mm -hmm. Actually, he charged. He he charged, and this unit had to flee. Oh, and we're now on your turn. Back to my turn. Back to his turn. By his turn, I mean. Sorry. Back to his turn. Okay, so now so his turn. He killed my so turn. your turn, he, he killed the Totemic Summons and your Nasher, which is not a surprise. But the summons kind of surprising. Oh, I guess one of those characters was on you, wasn't it? Yes. Yeah. Character and two, two ogres. Yeah. Um, so he killed it. Turned turn to face. Turned to face. And then on his turn, declared a charge. Against your cab. And, against my cab, and they and had you, to flee. And you fled. They were lined up not to go off the board. And, then and they're going to be a re rollable nine to rally. So and then he redirected into that or that other cavalry unit, or he charged them first. And then he redirected to the other cavalry unit, okay. I believe, and ended up going this way a bit. Okay. And pushed him away from the thing. Right. Um, so we got that. Okay. Um, with break yeah. the spirit on him, he did not elect to try to long right. charge here. And he chaffed up your spider with his and his tigger. Tigger comes around, chaffs up my spider, mm -hmm. but. If you recall, top of turn five. If you recall, Tigers are leadership five. Do you mm -hmm. recall that conversation? I do, yeah. Okay. So even though he's chaffing me, I'm not worried about it because he's going to run when I terror check him mm -hmm. and get back out of there. And you're going to... And I'm going to charge that unit in the rear. And you're going to make your 58% chance and charge him in the rear. 58% chance? Your leadership eight, right? Oh, to redirect? Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that was my whole plan. Mm -hmm. um, didn't work out well. Okay. Because uh, I charged him, and he stood. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> he made his terror check and stood there, uh, and took the spider to the face. Okay. Um, so, but technically, it's a rerollable five, right? It would have been a rerollable yeah. five, yes. But he, to, you know, he wanted to insult me, so he made mm -hmm. it on the first one. Okay. Um, I did get off a of break the spirit on this unit on the hill because mm -hmm. you know I have rallied this unit okay. back here on my turn. Got off the uh, plus one toughness on the troll unit. Okay. With the BSB in it. Mm -hmm. And on the bottom of five, we were... were of course, BSB switched, it was like he switched sides. We're running out of time. Mm -hmm. So on the bottom of five, he declares a long charge into the boar boys with this unit. Mm -hmm. And... Takes three guys. <laughs> between the two different types of terrain, right. loses nine or ten wounds. Mm -hmm. And actually has a couple wounds on characters as well. He's actually very lucky he didn't, that reduced unit didn't reach there because I think he loses that fight. <laughs> um, anyway. Well, he's got three characters there, right? He still had three characters, but I've got uh, my general. character in there who's going to kill one of them mm -hmm. because his characters aren't tooled up to deal with me. Um, anyway. Still not sure he loses the fight, but okay. You don't think so? Well, it's still a good number of attacks coming at you. You're not your Calvary's strength four. Correct. Everybody in here, even including the. Uh, and he swings before anyway, you do. It's yeah. Five boars swinging at the same time as him. Um, yeah. Hitting on fours, wounding on fours. The general going at the same time as him. Actually, before his unit. The general goes first, right? So. Uh, probably his characters go at the same time as the general. They have great weapons, something. No, only the big guy. Oh, okay. They had paired weapons. Oh, paired weapons. Yeah. Okay. Or Iron Fist, I'm not sure which. Anyway, I don't. I again, I don't think he breaks that fight. Cause no, he, no, I'm sorry. I thought that, I thought all his characters had great weapons. No, he's bringing strength five or four down there, yeah. and that's not yeah, going to get that, through my. Yeah. That's not going to get through my two up armor yeah. very well. Anyway, I didn't think. Right. I thought he. I, I would have loved it, especially reduced coming right. in there. Sure. I think I munch it, but. Mm -hmm. Um. Anyway, so he loses this crap load there, but it doesn't really affect anything because he still has over a quarter of the unit with right. three of them. Mm -hmm. Um. He went for the double charge on the trolls, and both units failed this time. Okay. Yeah, they're, they're both, as you can see, long charges. Mm -hmm. And that's where we ended up. Okay. And very blurry in this yeah. game. 
we were running yeah. definitely running out of time. Got these mm -hmm. really blurry pictures, and then this crisp, nice clean yeah. It's like it's, it just goes back and forth. I think I have a headache now. Just making sure. <laughs> you know, now that I think about it, you killed the tigger. Is there three? Oh yeah, I mean, the spider did manage to kill the tigger. I think he only had two units left. I wonder if I got half points for that unit. Well, you only got two guys in it, so out of nine. Yeah. Yeah. I wonder if we thought about that. Mm, I don't know. Or did I just look at the character? The, uh, the, the footprint and thought it was okay. Yeah, I might not have. Because he's got... Yeah, anyway. Hmm. It's a good question. Oh, well. Mm, okay. Too late to matter anyway. Um, so that's going to do it. And that's where we ended on bottom of turn five. Okay. Again, if there's a turn six, he probably doesn't come down this hill for right. one thing. But if he does come down the hill and try that on turn five, then the boar boys eat him. Yeah. Including the spider. Mm -hmm. If he doesn't come off the hill, the spider goes, I think, really hammers that unit. Well, then he has to try to face you. Yeah. Right. Even if he faces me. I mean, I think I, the spider can take him. Mm -hmm. But anyway. Yeah. Um, the other, the, but then, you know, I've got the negatives to me, though, is these units, instead of trying this charge, these units just moves up to make sure they can make the charge next right, turn. Right, So, I mean, the whole game changes if there's another mm -hmm. turn, I think. So it's not quite clear. But anyway, um, so I did kill, I do have uh, two of my scoring units left. Mm -hmm. I don't think I get credit for the score, killing my own scoring unit through this, <laughs> through this. So we each killed two scoring units, uh, making the uh, objective a draw, secondary a draw. Okay. And a slight win to the Ogres. All right. Well, better than the last game. A whole lot better. Nine thousand per nine hundred percent. Yeah, there you go. Well, better it, than the last game. Well, it's infinite. Infinite. That's true. <laughs> everything times zero. Zero, zero. to no, yeah, it's a good point. Yeah. It's infinitely. You're infinitely better. Yes, infinitely oh, better. It's actually kind of surprising after that. Oh, you had your troll unit all the way up there, hanging out by itself. My opponent made the comment yeah. after the game. He's like, I was really impressed at how you recovered from that horrible deployment. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it was pretty awesome. Yeah. <laughs> like, thanks for the compliment. Yeah. I, I think. <laughs> <laughs> but it was, a, I, looking back at it, it was a horrible deployment. Yeah. Um, had that troll unit been in the line with the others? Yep, been in the middle. Has to go in the middle. It's, you know. <laughs> anyway. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. But, again, this was another army I had matched as a yellow. Right. And hit the yellow range. Yeah, yeah. So, not terribly, wasn't terribly disappointed mm -hmm. with how it went. Your team members, did they pull, do their part? Because um, clearly if you had a yellow matchup, the green ones should have swept. A teammate that had the green matchup oh, so did green not matchup. do well. Oh, okay. Do well. Yeah, we ended up with a green and three yellows, oh, which wow. is fine. Okay. Yeah. That's fine. Yeah. You just don't, you avoiding, you just, avoiding the goal the is getting a gr at least one green and avoiding all reds. Yes, yes. If you can get that, mm -hmm. you should do well because yeah. then you finish, you know, average points is 40. Right. You know, 10 from each game. All right. And if you can, you know, end up with a few 11s and 12s and then a 16, 17, mm -hmm. you're doing really well. Yeah. Especially considering the rounds are capped at mm -hmm. 60 points. You can only score a max of 60. Yep. So, anyway, so that's game two. All right. Thanks for.